So in this video, we are going to understand for the given control system with open loop transfer function is given OLTF. That is nothing but G of S into H of S. Now where is H of S? Since it is a unit steady state unity feedback we have they have given that's why they have not mentioned the g of s h of s value okay so given below explain what type of input signal give rise to a constant steady state error and calculate their values constant steady state errors you might have studied if there are three right error constants there are three position error velocity error acceleration error three constants are there. first we are having kp kv k a this is nothing but what position position error this is nothing but velocity error and this is nothing but acceleration error okay now the basic idea we can understand from this is that the these terms okay this all kb kp and ka are nothing but for the steady state deviation in out position okay so the error co constants whatever we are getting it basically why we are finding this we are finding in order to find the ability of the system whether it can reduce or eliminate the steady state error which is nothing but ESS we represent it as what ESS steady state error so for that purpose we are going to find out KP KV and K now KP how to find KV how to find and KA how to find for the given system first step is to identify which type of system is this on the screen I will display the table for that always remember that table it is very important so before going to the question let us first try to understand the table so without further delay we will go into the question so in this open loop transfer function first we have to find the type or we have already discussed how to find the type we have to just see the number of poles present in the system okay here there is no s term sitting alone so this is uh, we can say this is nothing but a type 0 system so in type 0 system which constant and which constant will be 0 or infinite and which constant we have to find out that is a question arising now now always remember for the type 0 for the type 0 only a step signal gives rise to a constant steady state error okay type 0 only the step signal unit step okay unit step signal will give rise to what steady state error for that purpose we have to find the kp value so how to find the kp value which is nothing but equal to limit s tends to 0 what is the equation g of s into h of s okay now here as I mentioned here in the question they have not given H of S. Always remember that when they will not mention H of S it is always a unity feedback system. Okay. So it is not necessary they have to mention H of S. This is nothing but open loop transfer function which is nothing but G of S into H of S. H of S is 1 in unity feedback that's why they have not mentioned here. So that means we have to take only the G of S value whatever given in the question directly copy paste. So limit S tends to 0. 20 divided by s plus 1 into s plus 4 now i hope you know how to find the limit basically you have to just substitute the value in the given equation s equal to 0 when you substitute what will happen 20 divided by 0 plus 1 1 0 plus 4 4 it is 20 by 4 which is nothing but 5 so i got kp value now the question comes why am I finding only KP? What about KV and KA? Velocity error and acceleration error. As I said, we have to find the type of the system first. For the type 0 system, we have to find step signal. For the step signal, KP value we have found. But KA and KV value for the step signal, it will be what? 0 kv and ka value both will be 0 so for type 0 unit step we have to find kp value kv and ka value is equal to 0 now after finding this it is not over we have to find the values also that means steady state error formula we are having ess which is equal to 1 by 1 plus kp 
So 1 divided by 1 plus kp value we got it as 5. So 1 by 6 is the steady state error. ESS denoted by ESS. Okay, SS is subscript. So that thing you have to remember. Let us solve few more problems then only you will understand. Now second question we are having here is EFS value open loop transfer function they have given. Here also first we have to find the type of the system. What is the type of the system here? As you can see one S is sitting alone. So there is one S power 1 is there. That means this is type 1 system. Okay. So in type 1 system what happens? Again the table you have to see. In type 1 system the only a ramp signal will give you the constant steady state error ramp signal remember type 1 only ramp signal there it was unit signal here it is ramp signal now ramp signal we have to find how to find that again for the ramp signal which value we will be calculating we will be calculating kb value kb value is equal to limit s tends to 0 s into g of s into h of s one additional term will come s that's it is the same thing now gfs into hfs here gfs is there hfs again um, the same thing hfs is one because unity feedback so directly copy paste the question so limit s tends to zero s into don't forget about s 10 s plus 4 divided by s into s plus 1 into s plus 2 this and this is cancel now we have to substitute zero inside the equation that means substitute 0 see the thing is that if you substitute before cancelling the s value from the numerator as well as the denominator that will automatically become 0 then you, no use of that after cancelling only you have to substitute 0 value so when you substitute what will happen 10 into 0 plus 4 it is 4 divided by 0 plus 1 1 into 0 plus 2 2 so it is nothing but 20 so kb value you got it as what 20. What about Ka and Kp values? So for the ramp signal and type 1 system, the Kp value will be equal to infinite and Ka value will be equal to 0. Okay, this thing you remember. K, K, A value is equal to 0 and Kp value is infinite. Okay, now the question is not over. You have to find the steady state error which is equal to 1 by Kv kv is there that's why 1 by kv okay so 1 by 20 which is equal to 0 0.05 so i hope you understood the answer okay let us go for a few more problems last question we'll take again again the same thing type will be what s square is there it is type 2 okay type 2 system which one we have to find so open loop transfer function we are having two poles at the origin okay so it is a type 2 system and only for type 2 we are having a parabolic signal so parabolic signal will give rise to what constant steady state error so we have to find k a value k a value is equal to limit s tends to 0 s square into g of s into h of s s square k okay so which is equal to limit s tends to 0 s square into the whatever the question is there just copy paste s square into s plus 1 into s plus 4 first cancel this two then you substitute the value of 0 so it will be 20 divided by uh, 0 plus 1 1 0 plus 4 4 so it is again 5 so k a value i got it as what 5 now after k a value what about k v and kp right kv value will be equal to infinite and kp value will be equal to infinite so we have to find for ka steady state error so that is equal to 1 by ka it is equal to 1 by 5 which is equal to 0 0.2 okay so this is how we have to solve the question simple 